are back at the rescue rooms in stealth, showcasing for you the best bands and musicians in Nottingham. And this week we're joined by a singer-songwriter. Please welcome Emily Martin. to the regional finals of Open Mic UK in Liverpool, how did you get on? Um, I didn't get through, um, but uh, it, I mean, in the end, um, it wasn't the kind of competition that I really wanted to be in um, right. once I got there, so I wasn't too upset or too worried about it. Um, I've been working on my own stuff since I came back. I guess it must have been quite a boost though to win. To get win through the to the regional stage. finals, yeah, definitely. It, how I was, many people I was on go high. through? Is it like just, um, just I'm not sure entirely how many, how many people go through, but thousands of people apply, and then I think there's usually about 15 to 20 people in each regional final, so yeah, yeah it was quite so nice to get going, through. Good going then, that's cool. And I've read that you're, you're inspired by sort of life and your environment and, and often the NG5 area of Knotts that you're from. Yeah, hence Mansfield Road, which is the song that I wrote about the weirdos on Mansfield Road. Yeah. Was there any like, particular event that made you write that track? Um, well, I've, I've lived on Mansfield Road for a few years with my mum and of course I still live in that general area. So, yeah. And you do see some interesting sights on Mansfield Road. It's... See, I think there's worse places in Nottingham. I there are know. worse. It's not the worst. It's not bad. I find yeah. it interesting. I love yeah. to just wander up and down Mansfield Road and take in all the weird. It's great. <laughs> your own songs for? Um, well I used to be in a band um, called Penny Black and um, we were playing all around Nottingham for ages but um, they, we kind of disbanded and, and, and I didn't do anything for ages and then I just um, I knew a few chords on the guitar but I realised that I had to stop relying on other musicians to kind of make music with me I had to right. start doing it on my own I never thought of myself as a good enough guitarist to just pick up and write right. um, and then in April last year I just started practicing the guitar really hard and, and started writing songs and, and I've been gigging since May So you've had quite a few gigs in Nottingham, where, where do you like playing the most? Um, I like to play at Jam Cafe, I think Jam Cafe is a really yeah. nice place cool to play. Um, and um, I've played at the Maze a couple of times, I like playing the Maze. We used to play yeah. the Maze with my old band quite a lot, so it's, it's a good place to play. Yeah, like they're great it. for local bands They and really local are, musicians. yeah, very supportive. Always, yeah. So So when can people see you performing around not soon? 
Uh, well, I've got a, ge uh, a gig at Rock City, which is quite scary, um, on the 4th of April. It's a Sunday. It's like a, an all-day charity event. They're doing showcase oh, of like Nottingham oh, Talent. Yeah. Is it's a charity fundraiser. Yeah. Is it the one where they've got lots of cover bands? Lots yes. Like, that would be great to play yes. Rock City, though. What yes, I'm very chance. excited and also terrified at the same time. Because last year was huge. Yeah. Really, not scary. <laughs> quite a big crowd. Mm -hmm. It's a really good event. Really good fun. So remember, if you're from Nottingham and you write to perform your own music and you'd like to be on This Is Live, then send me an email to zoe.kirk at nottinghameveningpost.co.uk. And thanks again to Emily Martin. Thank, Thank you. you.